Hey guys, this is Hetu and welcome or welcome back to ETL QL Labs. I hope that you all are doing good. And uh, guys, it, this video will be very short video because I wanted to show you the you know result of the survey that I have posted uh, posted for all of you on community tab. And uh, thank you who all have taken this survey, right? So what I wanted to do is I wanted to take a survey wherein I wanted to prioritize which topic to be covered next right uh, it was because i was getting lot of requests and uh, those were kind of mixed uh, kind of uh, you know uh, requests somewhere on informatica data warehousing and software testing concept right and that was basically i wanted to fix that part that what you guys wanted right and then hence i have posted this uh, you know uh, survey and uh, you see that people have taken the survey and 53% out of the total people uh, who has taken the survey are interested to learn the Informatica series, right? And uh, this is going to be from very basic zero level, okay? And 29% uh, and people wanted, uh, you know, data warehousing, 18% wanted the software testing concept, so which obviously I have to prioritize the 53% because this most of the people wanted, right? And uh, so thank you all who have taken uh, the survey for this. And uh, that is the reason I told that please take the survey so that I can decide. And uh, thank you for shorting out, you know, for my, you know, for me to do the further videos. And now I can uh, start this uh, Informatica series for all of you. And uh, this is going to be very, very interesting, guys. And believe me, you don't need any prerequisite. Uh, are you don't need any prior knowledge of informatica okay what you need is you just need um, your intention to learn this tool this is very very simple tool informatica and uh, uh, you don't need to do too much coding everything is there you just need to use those you know um, uh, things there in informatica right you don't need to write hundred lines of code etc okay there are already tools uh, are components which you have to just use it okay you need to know how to use and when to use what basically transformation you need to use when right so that is the reason it is very very simple tool uh, but yet very powerful and very demanding in the market i think okay so wherever you go for interview whether as a developer or tester if you are working on an ETL, most of the people will assume that you know the Informatica, okay? Because this is one of the one of the you know um, most popular tool, and uh, uh, you know uh, that is the reason people expect you to know that, okay? You don't know any other tool that is all right, but you should know the Informatica. If you're saying ETL means they will assume that you know the Informatica, okay? So that is the reason it is very important. There are so many tools in the market, guys, not only Informatica. There are so many tools, for example, for SAP, have the SAP BODS, uh, and then you have um, Oracle also is having some tool. I mean, all the, all the major, uh, you know, uh, this... Uh, uh, companies are having their own tool okay but this informatica uh, is one of the one of the you know most popular tool okay now uh, what we will do is I, as i told you i will try to explain you in in much more you know um, easiest way so that you can learn okay uh, and guys i will request one more thing i might be using you know uh, many places little bit of uh, sql queries okay that i am expecting that you should know okay uh, by learning the informatica little bit of uh, understanding how to write queries and how to write substring etc okay group by order by etc because there are transformation which basically are using all those so you have to use uh, the sql queries inside those if you want to put some specific conditions right so i would request you that that uh, please go and watch my sql videos and uh, if you are already familiar with sql you don't need to worry about it okay if you don't know anything then i uh, i would suggest that go and watch my sql videos before we start uh, you start you know doing this all right now um, so this is all about uh, this survey guys okay and uh, just before we start that we begin the session right what we have to do is 
uh, I would request you guys to you know follow me along okay why because when you follow me what I am coding I will be taking I will not be doing a big bang videos okay I will be doing um, uh, the videos uh, Anyway, the, the, the easiest part I will take you step by step guys and I will also you know ensure that you are not you know uh, you are you are not uh, um, I will I will not be covering so many things in a single session also right so this video this entire session will be very very interesting so that's the reason I am saying that please do uh, uh, learn little bit of SQL if you don't know uh, if you don't have time that is also fine I think I think you might uh, learn it later point of time how when you learn the informatica I will obviously co cover the concepts uh, of SQL uh, when I will be doing the coding then you can actually go and watch those as well okay now what exactly is prerequisite for doing this uh, practice uh, together with me is that you have to do this installation part of Informatica guys so this Informatica power center installation you have to follow this and this is free of cost okay this installation is little lengthier okay as I have explained in this video two videos first you have to follow this first video that is related to installation second one is the configuration server configuration guys yeah so make sure you are done with this and then you are ready to you know follow me right so that is the reason I have made these two videos so that you can um, you can follow me along when I do uh, the when I uh, you know start practice uh, when I perform this all these tasks right now what I will do is once you are done with it okay then obviously uh, you know I will uh, I will uh, take you from uh, you know starting very starting so uh, if you already have Informatica or you are already working in companies or something you don't need to do much about it you already have Informatica you can use that same Informatica for you alright so guys um, this is all about this okay now um, other thing is uh, what I will do is maybe let me okay what I will do is basically uh, I will come up okay the topics all right I will come up with the topics uh, whenever I do video but that will be very sequential okay so you can just follow I will after that I will be putting into uh, once I do the video I will be putting uh, all those videos into Informatica this particular this is the playlist guys okay you can just follow me and I will ensure that if you are following step by step okay one by one then uh, there will not be any problem for you to learn it okay so just uh, follow that and uh, the best thing is that uh, you should follow when I do uh, you know when I post my video then you can also just follow it and uh, you can do it on the same day basically okay and I will ensure that it is not a lengthy videos okay so it might be uh, it might be maybe 15 or 20 minutes maximum okay so that is the reason that is uh, the you know way how you can learn it and when you do along with me then you also ensure that you are you are uh, getting the concepts and uh, if you have any doubt etc you can always post it on the comment box then I can clarify okay so that is what guys I wanted to cover in this video and uh, then um, uh, hope that this video this entire series will be very exciting and uh, I will be able to at least you know help you guys to uh, learn Informatica okay so that's all guys and uh, I think uh, once we cover this uh, in this Informatica series you know uh, it's not that I'm not going to cover data warehousing concept and software testing concept they are also my priority but guys we have to prioritize which one to first right so that is the reason this is the topic that I wanted okay first of all let me cover this and uh, while I do the video it is not only from the development point of view this can also be from the testing point of view because uh, when I do coding for each of the transformation when I uh, you know do that you also uh, you know I will also tell you how to test them okay guys so don't worry about it if this video is it will be truly enriching for both developer and tester guys okay if you're working in that capacity right either developer or tester uh, don't worry about it so this will be complete uh, 
package i would say okay so both the community development community and testing community both can follow this video and uh, then you can get everything clear here okay so that's all guys i think uh, let's uh, wrap it up here and then i will see you soon with uh, you know the series uh, i will start the series guys okay all right thank you thank you for watching and thank you for taking the survey guys this is really uh, this really sorted me now all right and uh, until then i will see you soon with the with the next video until then happy learning god bless you bye